All right, YouTube, welcome back to the channel. So let's get right into this video. Let's talk about the higher the suffering, the higher the purpose. All right, so anyone that has a big purpose in their life, like you're destined to do something, whatever the thing is, you're gonna have a high amount of suffering that comes with whatever this per whatever this purpose is, right? So if you're watching this video, you probably already know what I'm talking about. And you're the type of person that's probably gone through a lot of different things. I'm talking about long-term suffering, like suffering to the point where it's like you're so you're so used to it to where you're like, hold up. Like you're just like desensitized to it, right? It's just long, constant, constant battles, tribulations and everything. Constant stuff is gonna get you tired, right? And whatever the suffering is, it's all unique to every person. But anyone that's truly purpose to do something, right? Like you're chosen for a specific purpose, something that you're created to do. Because of that purpose, there's gonna be a huge amount of suffering that comes with it. And you hear about this every single time. Anyone that was ever, everyone that ever became like some sort of person in power, right? Like maybe they became like famous with something or whatever it is. Usually you hear about that they suffered a lot, like especially during their younger years. Like they had a lot of things that happened to them. They were like brutal or like really tough or whatever these are. Or like anyone that was like, maybe they ended up to be like extremely wealthy, like business owners. And like they created like a really good business, a righteous business and everything. You would hear about their earlier life and everything. And then you hear that they suffered with like, it could be like abuse or something. It could be like drug addiction. It could have been homelessness, right? They could go from homelessness to multimillionaire and stuff like that. If you have a big purpose, your life is going to show you the opposite for a long time. It's always going to correlate with whatever that purpose is. But you're gonna go through really high amounts of suffering, right? It's gonna be constant and like long. It's gonna start early and it's gonna last, right? And that's the truth. But you, you already know this though that even throughout all the suffering, you've never ever like lost faith, right? You've always been the type of person that you you keep looking up, like you you still have faith in that the vision that you have. You still feel like you're gonna be in a good like a good place. You still feel like you're gonna reach, you know, success, right? You're gonna reach the life that you've been dreaming about, the vision that you have, right? You always feel like you can still do it, even if your life shows you the complete opposite, where it seems like it's like impossible, right? The reason it feels impossible is because without God, it would be impossible, but you have God with you. So your life is gonna feel like it's something that's impossible. It's gonna feel like it's something that doesn't budge. It's like you can't, you just like can't break through it, right? But just know that the higher the suffering that you go through, the higher that your purpose is. So this is a fact. Anyone that's ever gone through really heavy things for a long amount of time, they always end up having a breakthrough, an extreme breakthrough to where they go up insanely high, where they reach success, where they reach places that they've never thought that they've ever reached. They broke through things they never thought they were gonna break through. They, they just go from one end to the other, from all the way to the bottom, to all the way to the top, right? And it's supposed to be this way because also we don't war against flesh and blood, right? It's principalities. And if you have a purpose from God, principalities can see that, right? Because their whole purpose is to stop you and put you down. So you get thrown a lot of things. You get thrown a lot of stuff that's going to try to drag you down. You get thrown things like sickness. You get thrown things like financial loss, whatever it is, homelessness, uh, drug addictions, whatever it is. It could be all types of things like relationship issues, all types of issues. It's all unique to the person. And, and in this video, I'm not saying that no other people don't suffer. Like everyone goes through their suffering. There's, there's no single person on earth that has zero problems. It doesn't go through like tribulations and everything. But I'm saying if you've been the type of person to notice like extreme battles, like really hard battles and like suffering from a young age i'm talking about really young like from only like five six years old or something it already started or like 10 years old or something because it started really early it usually starts really early right and it's like constant battle after battle after battle like things that you go through a lot of problems and everything like 
life feeling like it has insane amounts of resistance, right? And the more you, the more you like try to go through it, the harder it gets and everything. That's how your life is going to feel if you're chosen, right? This is why your life doesn't move the same way as other people because it can't because you got somewhere else you got to be. You're going to, you're going to be met with a lot of resistance, right? But you know, every single time you met with all this resistance, whenever you're at the point where you're like, oh, I can't even do this. Like, this is not possible. Like, why do I even try? You find out that you still can't give up. Like, you still keep doing it and keep doing it and keep doing it. It's like you find out that you can't really, you can't really back down even if you let yourself back down because that vision is so strong because it comes from God. So he's, he's always pushing you, right? He's always pushing you. This is why you could go through so many different things all at the same time and you still keep it moving, right? You still, you still might find out, you still might ask yourself, you're like, you're just like, how come I can't just like stop doing this? What, why do I, why do I keep trying? Like you see all these failures or whatever it is, you see all this like suffering, you see all these things and you're, you're, you're going to be like, man, what's the point of this? Like, I can't even do it. Like, I'm just going to stop. I'm going to do something else. Like, I'm not going to go try this anymore. I'm not going to do this anymore. But every time you try to do that, all of a sudden you get like energized again. All of a sudden you get this like strength again. You, you keep trying, you keep going, you keep going, you keep going and everything, right? Because that all comes from God. You have God pushing you the whole time. You have God with you. So without, without Christ, right, it can't be done. Without God, it's impossible. You could do all things through Christ, uh, through Christ who strengthens you, right? That's where your strength comes from. Your strength isn't just yours. It comes from God as well. You have the strength of God with you. Because anyone that's purposed by God, who God has chosen them for, whatever God has chosen them for, it's going to be with God. It's not going to be you and yourself. It's going to be you and God, right? So the, uh, the trials and tribulations that you face, the suffering is God difficulty, right? Like a human probably can't solve that problem. A human probably can't do it themselves right you can only do it with god that's the type of suffering that you go through to at the point where it's like it can't be done unless god comes here right that's the only way so just know if you're the type of person who's been going through you know long suffering which is a gift of the holy spirit too that's why you could go through suffering for such a long time because it's a gift from the holy spirit long suffering but if you're that type of person going through long suffering that means that you have a higher purpose right before, before you reach the destination, it's always going to be huge amounts of battles, huge tribulations, huge problems that come on, losses that come up, uh, stuff that's going to test you, stuff that's going to try to break you, stuff that's going to try to make you quit and everything. Remember, the enemy, all he does is try to get you to quit, right? So you can get thrown a lot of things. But you already know that you can't quit. Like, you just can't quit, even if you try. Even if you try to quit whatever that you're doing. And if you know that you're going to your purpose and everything. If you ever try to quit that purpose, you're not going to be able to quit it. No matter what comes no matter what comes around in your life, you're not going to be able to quit it. It's going to be impossible. You're just going to keep going for some reason. Just you're not going to be able to quit. You're just going to keep moving even if you're like, "Oh, I don't even feel like it." For some reason, you still get the urge to do it and keep doing it, right? But yeah, if you truly do resonate with this video, you know exactly pretty much exactly what I'm talking about. If you've gone through situations like this, where it's like back to back to back to back to back, it's always like you're fighting something. If you go through these situations and it's been like this your whole life, you know that you're chosen, right? You know that you have a different purpose. And not only do you already feel it, you already feel like you do. It all comes from the spirit. You probably already have a vision that, you've ha that you have. And you might've had this vision for a long time. It might've not been as clear as it is now, but you've always had like a certain vision about what you want to do it's like a dream that you have right the same vision the same vision comes from god that's why it's so strong this is why you always you're always able to see it and this is why whenever you think about that vision you have like a fire inside of you right and that's what makes you not quit because you need that type of strength to do it right and that type of strength comes from god but yeah that's pretty much the whole video I hope you guys enjoyed this video 100%. I hope this helped you guys. I know many of you could resonate to this video. It's something that I resonate with as well. Anyone that's chosen, 
for a type of purpose that God has for you, this is how your life is going to move. It's all going to be unique to every single person, but it's going to move in this type of way, right? But yeah, of course, don't forget to like, don't forget to comment, don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed already. All right, God bless you guys, and I'll see you in the next video.